building the hall. And so this is really a win-win for, I mean, for Africa actually, and for Rwanda and for Biontech actually. You can, we can pioneer our technology here with the help of Rwanda and the African Union. So we designed these biontainers so that they are mobile, so that you can produce them somewhere else and maybe produce a couple of them, but then deploy them quickly anywhere in the world. So in the, the first time we, we test this outside of Germany is really here in Rwanda. So um, we tested this in Germany before with trucks. So you can load them on a truck. In principle, you can put them on a boat, but we said we need to really test how, how well can we ship them if there's an urgency, how fast can we deploy them with the plane. So we had to test the plane route. And this is why we, we rented the, the big plane here in the background. Apparently, the whole, yeah, they fit in, they arrived safely. So we can, in the future, bank on flying them by plane. It came uh, through a process of partnership. Uh, but because Rwanda actually was the first country to use mRNA vaccine on this continent, um, and we used more than 50% of Pfizer-BioNTech vaccine in Rwanda. And from there, uh, the partnership was built uh, from the top leadership. His Excellency, our President himself, has been uh, really advocating for our continent, for Africa, that we should not uh, be the last on the queue asking for vaccine or for medicine if we can produce them here on our continent. So now it's a dream becoming reality because of his efforts, the teamwork, the partnership, but also the science that has been really linking um, on bringing solution where the problem is. So currently, Africa consumes more than 99% of vaccine it produces. The African Union has been uh, pushing to at least reduce that by half by uh, in the next 20 years or more. But this is a step forward that you can even use it to a few years uh, because some countries like Rwanda and others, there are three other countries like Senegal and South Africa uh, that will be part of this partnership. Uh, and it's, it's, it's really a big day uh, for the science, uh, but also for what um, a country like Rwanda can can do uh, with uh, our uh, within our continent, uh, and we see already more other partnerships coming along with this uh, in the framework of reducing the gap between um, where the disease are and where the solutions are. So we should have more vaccine medicine produced here uh, because we have the highest disease burden.